welcome to the day in the life of a 22 year old real estate agent. This is day five of this series. It is about 8.35. I forgot to record this morning, sadly, so I'm going to bring you up to date right now on what we got going on today. So today, um, made some dials, still got some more to do. Wanted to get this out of the way real quick. Um, that way we're kind of on the same page all day long. So made some dials this morning, had a couple good conversations. I do have a for sale by owner preview this morning. And really what I'm trying to do with that is just get in the door, introduce myself, show them a little bit about what we do. Um, I'm not super, I'm not a super pushy, hard salesman. Um, I take more of a relationship based approach. Um, and when they see you in person, it kind of ingrains them in their mind because if not, you're just one of the other hundred agents who call these for sale by owners. It's actually kind of funny. I get people who come up, to, other agents who come up to me all the time and they're like, you talk to that for sale by owner over there? I'm like, yes. Um, and it, it's just a pride thing. I, I love when they do that because it shows that I'm out there. I'm, you know, putting in the time to get these for sale by owners and I've actually converted three of them this year. Um, one was at an $800,000 price point. One was a listing I had go live yesterday, and then one's the one that was back on the market. So it does work. Um, it's all a reps thing. You know, I've probably been on 50 previews this year, and I've turned three. So it's a lot of time to put into it, but it's great when you finally land one, especially in this market, because things are selling fast. And then at 10.30 today, I have a listing appointment um, for that one that canceled on Wednesday. So that got rescheduled just confirmed that we are good to go so hopefully we're staying good with that one we go out there she's not quite ready but you know we're going out there make the introduction show her what we do that way we're on her radar when the time does come down the road and then after that um hopefully have a couple buyer showings uh, we're waiting on a schedule change kind of see what happens so i will see you guys in the next one all right so we just got back from our appointment went really well. Um, I'm going to send her over a couple numbers, a couple things she can do to get the house ready for the market. Um, I have another appointment coming up here soon that I got to get going for. We were able to get a price cut on listing A that I have, so that's going to be dropping. And then we are having quite a few showings on my newest listing that just hit the market today. So we're expecting an offer coming in, just got off the phone with one of the agents. So I will keep you guys posted and I will see you guys after my appointment. All right, so we just got back from our for sale by owner appointment there. Really awesome house over there in the 05. It's a really popular area here in Fort Wayne, and it's really just going crazy. So got that. Um, answered a couple questions for a couple agents on my listing B that went live yesterday. So we're hoping to get some offers in on this. Uh, we got a couple more showings for it, and then we do have an open house tonight from 5 to 7. So hopefully that's off the walls. Um, and then for the rest of today, we did get our price cut on listing A. So that has now been cut. We did get a showing right afterwards. So we got hope in that one. So we're going to keep uh, powering along and uh, I'll see you guys in the next clip. All right, so I'm about to record my Hamilton Lake Market update. So I'm going to give you guys a behind the scenes look at it. So here we go. All right, what's up everybody? It's Michael with McAfee Home Group. It is Friday, so we're doing the Hamilton market update. So let's get into the numbers here. So for active, we saw no change. Um, we stayed at 13 from last week to this week. Pending, same deal from 13 to 13, so no change there, and then sold from seven to six. Remember, that's only the past 30 days, so they're just timing out as we keep updating these. Um, if you guys have any questions regarding any property that's for sale in Hamilton, feel free to give me a call and enjoy your weekend. All right, so we just did that. And all that does is um, there's a Hamilton Lake group that I posted into. It keeps people up to date on what the market's doing because if you're not in the real estate industry, you're not really paying that close of attention. So I like to do these short, quick videos. That way they can watch it, get what they need to know, and be done with it. I've had some great feedback from it, so I'm gonna keep doing it and I'll see you guys in the next clip. All right, so I just made a little snippet video from what my listing C that I have on the market right now. Um, it is a lake property, so just made a little snippet of the drone photo we got and a couple boat shots that we got just to kind of keep keep it in front of everybody's eyes. Um, and this just helps, you know, get the word out there. You know, we run a couple ads with it, so get it out there on Facebook, Instagram, stuff like that. We also provide a link for that so they can view the whole property. Um, and this just helps, you know, mix it up a bit keep it keep it fresh keep it in the cycle keep people clicking on it looking at it stuff like that that way your listing doesn't go stale because you never want that to happen 
Other than that, today I think that's going to be about it. Um, I'm finishing out the day with a couple emails, a couple more phone calls, and we're going to enjoy the rest of our Friday night. So thank you for watching the first full week of the day in the life of a 22-year-old real estate agent, and stay tuned for next week.